Good morning, good morning watu wangu. Good morning, good evening and good afternoon. Whatever you are watching me. Thank you so much for choosing to watch me. Kama ku choose ya. Hey guys, mkwaje, mkwaje. Nimewahata sana sana. Thank you for always watching my YouTube YouTube channel. Thank you for always um subscribing by the way my new subscriber karibuni sana and you have, if you are a returning subscriber from longest time ago since tuanza hiki to your youtube guys thank you so much by the way i do appreciate saseni so guys leo nimesema tu nitaongeresha kama naenda job sababu yeah natafuta anga time by the way natafuta anga time sana ya kuongea unapata ni, niko na comment au niko na, na uh, information i need to give out but sina ile time exactly and i hope unanisikiza sababu na drive sina otherwise no so i hope unanisikiza guys so um napata anga two comment na nataka kujibu but na shindo nitajibu nikiwa wapi sina hiyo exact time so nikipata tu time hata kama naenda job hata kama na drive nasema hey you know what acha tu nijibu hii as in nijibu that comment so guys niko hapa tu kujibu that one comment um naonanga comment zenyu by the way i do appreciate unachukua time ya kuwatch my video and you are commenting and maybe sometime una share you and you una subscribe i do appreciate but guys Hii social media thing. Okay, haters lazima kukuwe na haters and lazima kukuwe na mtu hawezi ona the same na mimi. You know like your view kuna mwingine ako na reason tofauti, mwingine ako na view tofauti. That's so normal. So if not on on my YouTube channel but even kwa mtu mwingine. Ah, but I have comment something bad as in all. But I have comment something yenye unaona eh hey, huyu uyo tu ni ku hate not even advise it's a hate you know kwani ushidi uki comment si basi waachane tu nayo no si lazima mind ku comment something not only on my youtube channel kwa mtu mwingine mind ku comment something yeye unaona cuz wo wo fly that that person ama u fly wherever anafa anasema acha ku comment just keep it cuz let's say like kuna mtu mwingine ataba anafaidika. Wewe una wewe unasikia hiyo kitu inakuudhi. Maybe kuna mtu mwingine anafaidika. Mtu mwingine anauliza, "Oi, wa akio Yesu, eh, sisi weke hiyo information ndio nijue." Na wewe unasikia kama ni vibaya. Like I had this comment that huyo mtu anasema, "He, unatuambia tu vitu za Amerika. Sijui huku Kenya ni kama uh, you are, you are making us feel like we are out." <laughs> Ati jababu sababu nasema something yenye in America unafaidika. Um sa ana feel like I'm talking of only about what wenye wako America. It's like namuumiza sababu it's like ana feel ako kwa Kenya ako left out. So that's what I understand the comment but I was like sasa kuna mtu atafaidika na hiyo wewe uko Kenya na maybe unasikia uh, maybe god haja kuzijaria ufike hapa but kuna mtu ako in that process na kuna mtu god ame siku yake imefika so ako hapa anakuja atapata hiyo information so si ati na naongelelea na, na, na ni wewe ufeel vibaya sababu siku yako ijafika but naiongelelea cause kuna mtu ako kwa hiyo process na for sure atakuja kutumia those those uh, item get or those benefits like example now on my today comments na ongerere about about um healthcare and medicaid and um food stamp i nilipata that comment that comment was um mimi uh, alikuwa anasema like mimi if if ni kuje that america i know mind about those benefits what i might it's my dream uh, my dream uh, what my dream my my dream come true like american dream so um just let let me let me clarify up by the way those benefits ni ukiwa na documents mtu mwenye hana document guys na drive so mtani tutalao tu venye tunaenda na lights ndio so ukiwa na zile document usipokuwa na zile document always but those benefits cause bado hujafika kukuwa uh, residence bado ukiwa residence 
ndio una get those benefits sababu we ni residents na ukiwa residents means like um uko na uko na una, una government iko allowed upate zile um zile benefits mu America anaweza get so does it mean at ukipata zile food stamp ama ukipata medicaid uko in a public charge why cause ukikuja add a green card acha nifanye hivi guys cause naona lighting si poor video hiyo side so ukikuja add a green card the most most thing na i know when you mna just a green card sahi or one wako lazima ukue hivyo lazima u provide um, a host lazima u provide a host na host akuwa amekupea zile documents za ku make uh, at yeye ataweza ku host na atakuwa ada, it's like your sponsor it's like what the gulf gulf wins and a bigger sponsor either ni kampuni either ni mtu ameku host ama nini lazima uende na ile kampuni sio akuwa as a sponsor wako sema hapa ukiwa most ukikuja na na green card ama mtu akutumie visa kuna zile documents wanakuulizanga ndio at ukikuja hapa huyo mtu ni yeye ameku host so si uh, ati why kwa nini kwa nini government ya America inaitishanga those document ni sababu wataki ukue public charge that is yet unakuja hapa usaidiwe na serikali so wana, lazima hata uwezi pita hata uwezi enda far without a host lazima u provide the documents a host kwa ile DS260 wenye wanajaza DS260 saa hii wanajua lazima you provide a host lazima umweke hapo like this is my host atani host na ile siku utaenda interview utapea na those documents za kuonesha na ule host anaweza ku host anaweza kushikilia miaka yote hapo yani ni kama yeye yeah, ali, ali ulipoa visa na, na gava but a host ni muhimu lazima akwe hapo so ukichukua okay, zile um, zile uh, food stamp si ati unachukua juu uko under public charge hawezi ni just because ukikuja na green card unakuwa sasa wewe uko resident na uko uko na zile benefit ni, 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 ni part of ni part of you as in zile benefit is part of you so usposi chukua it's okay ukichukua si ati uko in a public charge unasaidiwa na serikali it's just like it's part as nilikwambia if uh we'll watch our uh, last my last video about some of the struggles so tuseme we utaki kuchukua hizo benefits ha huh? hautaki kabisa then uko na mtu hii unahitaji amount a lot of amount kulipa ile take care afu sema mi he mimi mi heritu ni ishi dream uh, my dream is to be uh, kuishi american dream so sasa kuchukua hizo vouchers ama sasa kulipwa na serikali take care utaweza kulipa hiyo take care utaweza kulipa hiyo take care and then maybe let's say like uko single mom hauna mtu mnasaidiana na ye cause kama 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 has, ukiwa na hazi ama ukiwa na wife inakuanga bado struggle kule ya mtu hii sababu it's like mna exchange ule anaenda huyu anakuja na kana mtoto unaenda job ule mwingine anaingia unaenda na hivi mnapita nanga hivi so if huyo if hata ukiwa na, na a second but na anakuwa ni struggle what if ukiwa peke yako uko na watu wawili wewe ni single mama au you ni single dad uko na watu wawili na lazima uende job sababu bills nazo lazima ulipe so kuchukua zile food stamp ama zile voucher is not like you are in public charge it's just is a part of kukua ada ada green card ada residence permit au ukiwa na ile residence you may get so um so kitu kingine about health healthcare about healthcare unaweza kosa kuchukua healthcare but ile kampuni unafanya job lazima watakulipia wa, lazima watakukata pesa za kuwa na healthcare healthcare in america is super expensive hawezi sema ati yao oh, mi sitachukua hiyo sitachukua hiyo healthcare sitachukua nitataka kampuni ah nitataka kujilipia healthcare what God forbid when the hospital tutumua unatumua bill unashangaa unashiru utaitoa wapi so ukiwa na, na ile medicaid pia inakusaidia that ukie ukienda hosi ama mtoto wako ama whoever part of your family ako na medicaid si ati unalipa ile bills una get so medicaid ni na love medicaid haibangu kila mtu 
Medicare inapewa ni part of benefits but inapewa only ladies and kids only women and kids only women and kids you wanna pata med kit most of guy aki leo leo light si poa sana kabisa so most of men apa hawana med kit most of men hawananga med kit like my husband ananga med kit ni reapply med kit yake aka aka kuwa yeye hayezi get first of all in america men come as a fourth category so akuna venya ti mwanaume ataamka tu apewe med kit vivi ata kama aki apply ata kama alikuja na green card they don't even care cuz like mine the apply zote lakini nilileta yangu na amani as in my baby so men hapa ukupata med kit anajifanyia kazi ana kwa ile kampuni na mkata pesa ya insurance alafu ana unakuwa we uko ada uko na ada insurance ya kampuni then kuna tofauti ya med and med kit med kit ni ya uh, old age from 55 and above so kama mimi ukikuja hapa una apply medicaid which is near young age from from zero that is from mtoto mdogo to 55 wanapoa medicaid na inaenda inakuwa inaexpireanga every year inaexpire like mine it may expire already in memory za one hapa it may expire inabidi iwali new na wali new wanali new ingi automatically or zara wali ni call the other day so medicaid ni ya ni ya Okay, Medicare ni ya, ni ya mtu uh, amekuwa old age na anapewa na gava kama alikuwa kazi yake, kazi yake ilikuwa na, na retirement so anapewa hiyo Medicare. Medicaid ni ya young age. So usi confuse hizo two things. Hizo ni two tofauti, two different things. Kuna food stamp which is si kila mtu ni ya ladies na maybe pregnant ladies na na, na kids and then medicare ni ya mtu akiwa 55 and above una apply hiyo ni, ni kama retirement benefits zenye unapewangwa insurance ya ya, ya, ya job hizo ni retirement government thing so i hope umeelewa so usiseme eti wewe kujapo unataka kukaa na your own rules that hey, since you can so bora tu mimi nimefika America fine it's fine but hizo vitu unazihitaji Uki, ukikosa kuhitaji hizo vitu fine fanya job apply your medicare your medicaid apply your medicare ukiwa ukuzeka zeka utafute medicare and then apply food stamps zako lipa bills zako hakuna mtu atakuuliza but usipokuwa uko na ile uwezo unahitaji hiyo vocha ya ya daycare unahitaji hizo medicare medicaid unahitaji hizo sababu hosi is very expensive na lazima upeleke mtoto hospitali lazima upeleke mtoto uh, up, uh, all the injections and your apwangwa utakukilipa bills every month every day every week sababu ati utaki utaki kuchukua benefits come on anyway ni that is my view anyway maybe kama wewe utaweza kuja hapa na usichukue usichukue any of those benefits go uh, it's well by the way it's very okay hata wako forcing ah ah hata iko force but for my side now na zinasaidia sababu eh kulipa hospitali ama kulipa all the uh, documents za mtoto venye ninaendanga hosi alafu na naambua nafanya hii nafanya hii injection ah si kama kuna kitu ya gavana ni niko ada this american residents inafaa kupata nitaendea mimi asiende uh, sababu niko in a public charge hakuna si atinasaidiwa na serikali first ni uh, ule sponsor ule host akijulikana ati alikuwa jiria sasa hiyo ndio nao ni shida cuz akikupea zile documents ana alikuwa na anasema atakushikilia then ukuje hapa sijui akuachilie na akutupanishe sijui sasa nao unaokotwa na serikali that's another case unaona that's another case so usi confuse hizo vitu zote but information yenye this na kupea ni ile ya one day ukikuja hapa ukiwa na residence some of the benefit una get i hope umeelewa i hope nimejaribu kuelezea my own way or my own way <laughs> i don't know i know kuna mtu mwingine anaelewa vizuri na anaelewa hizi document vizuri but at least na nasema 